Hey everyone, welcome back to the cave. So today was supposed to be one of those large unboxing videos. So we planned on unboxing six Black Series figures, but one of them did not show up today. So I'm gonna put that video on hold and hopefully that will come very soon. So right now it's late night in the action figure cave. The only lights that are on are the lights behind me and the Black Series display. So yes, after dark, in the cave. What's gonna happen tonight? We're gonna do a Hot Toys unboxing. You don't wanna miss this one, so see you in a bit. Okay, so here it is, the Hot Toys Death Trooper. And I really thought it was fitting to do a Hot Toys unboxing of the Death Trooper, being the season two of The Mandalorian is coming out at the end of October. Um, this one is the Specialist Trooper that is from Rogue One, but we did see some Death Troopers at the end of season one of The Mandalorian, so pretty cool uh, connection there. Um, but this one is a sold out, Hot Toys figure. I had to go to eBay to get this, and I really wanted it to go next to our director Krennic right there. And I do have a Mandalorian Death Trooper on pre-order to go on the other side of Krennic. So, all right. So enough of that. Can't wait to get this out of the box. So let's let's do it. folks so originally this was supposed to be a Instagram only unboxing but I am really glad that I took film of this and now have a video of it because I know it's the older Hot Toys figure but it is I am really blown away by it uh, it looks so super cool and it kind of gives everyone a little bit of an idea of what the Death Trooper that's up on pre-order right now. It's the regular Death Trooper from the Mandalorian slash Rogue One, so it's not the specialist, but you get a little bit of an idea of how good the weathering is on the armor, and you know, just the paint job on it is really good. Obviously, with the regular 
Death Trooper, you're not going to get the uh, shoulder patch here and the pauldron and the all this ammunition on the belt here. So, but the weathering on the armor is going to be pretty much consistent of what you see here. And that's one of the things I love about this figure is just the, the weathering on the black shiny armor kind of really stands out in the uh, cracks here of the um, of the armor. So, love the detailing on the uh, wrist here. Just looks fabulous. Like I said, though, the only way to get this figure is on a secondary market. I had to go to eBay to get it. Uh, I did pay a lot for it, but it's still not as much as the deluxe version of this figure. So there's a specialist deluxe version uh, that comes with a longer sniper rifle. It has the scope on the side over here, and the base is different, and also comes with a generous toy stormtrooper that you see in the Rogue One movie. So that one was even more pricey than this one, so I chose to go for this one. I do have a pre-order on the regular Death Trooper, so I'm gonna have them both around Mr. Krennic, um, which is gonna look really cool. So like I said, the detail on this figure just looks fabulous. The articulation is a little limited because of the suit underneath there, um, so not gonna get a great range of motion with this figure, but as you can see, when I had the figure up on the turntable, there is, um, I could get them in good poses, especially when you have the eight push out hands, you have the two different weapons, I really like this weapon here, where a nice paint job at the end here, and you have that silver and little purple there. Just amazing detailing. The only thing I do not care for, or I felt very underwhelmed by, it, is the lighting feature here. Uh, so the helmet here comes right off. It's pulled together by a magnet, but you have a switch right here, and it's just really very underwhelming. So I don't know if it's the batteries. I mean, this figure was brand new sealed uh, the batteries have been in the box for a while so i don't know if i would change if i change the batteries it will have a more brighter light but um really that's the only negative i have like i said the articulation is limited but still really good and the armor is tight it's not going to fall off um, just looks really good so anyway guys i hope you enjoyed this late night unboxing i'm not sure when the video will go up probably more like in the afternoon but i did film it at night so a few things about the channel, uh, there has been a few more subscribers of late, so I just want to say welcome to the cave. I really do appreciate all the watches and all the viewers and you know all the people who put up comments and everything. I really appreciate it. If you watch our videos and you haven't subscribed yet, just make sure you subscribe. Like I said earlier, we have a Black Series unboxing coming up. We're going to unbox six Black Series figures, so look for that to come out. I hopefully get the going to hunt very soon you know a lot more content coming up so we have a lot of things going on so definitely make sure you stick with us season two of the mandalorian is coming out pretty soon so go get yourself some death trooper action figures